How's it going, everyone? I'm Aaron Nick, and welcome back to Never Ending Nightmares. I just had the axe, and I broke down the wall, and it appears that the broom I'm in has changed yet again. Oh, this game is disturbing. That's the biggest thing about this game, is it's just... It's very, very disturbing. Everything that's happened. Okay, so the walls are decrepit, and I see that there's spider webs, so we have that going on. Dolls in the bathroom, okay. Glad we have everything in order in this house. That's, that's the important part. Ooh. That looked like, ooh, I don't, oh, I don't like that. It kind of looks like the sister's face. So, what I gather from the game so far is that the sister has died, or he maybe killed the sister. There's a possibility of that, because it had a knife stabbing into her. And he's unable to deal. Oh, okay, Lion Witch in the wardrobe coming right up. And he's unable to deal with it, and this is... Oh, I did just climb right into it. Or is that how you hide? Okay, so I might have to hide from a creature. Alright, so that wardrobe is there for me to be able to survive. I wish I could just pick up that lantern. That'd be really nice if he did, but he's not gonna. Alright, basement again. I pr probably can't go into the basement yet. It's probably going to be dark on like... Ah, oh, we'll see. The anticipa- oh, it is- oh, okay. It isn't the basement. It's just downstairs. I see how, uh, headphones is supposed to enhance the experience- ooh! It just blinked. Oh no. That was what I didn't want to happen. I think I might be going in the wrong direction. That's a possibility. Okay, dolls just everywhere. I don't know how long this game is, so I don't know how much build up there is. This could. This could just build up for a long, long time until everything is just completely torn down. But okay, that painting looks important. Check this room before going in the hallway, I guess. Anything? No. Nope. Wait, was I in this room before? I think I was. Yeah, the wardrobe's right up here, I believe. Yeah, it is. Okay, so I went in a circle. Oh, shit. What is that? I just saw a big hand. Oh, it's a baby. Alright, go by. Come on. Go go on by. A veiny baby. Look at that. He is ripped. He is, he is a jacked baby. He must be hitting the gym like three or four times a week. I I just keep this game is giving me like the cold chills. Just oh, oh it changed. It did change. All right, going down the basement again. See, I thought it was the same because the rooms were just about the same, but then it actually did did change. There's that, there's that creepy doll again. I hope it, please don't, please don't be any different. Okay, it's just cracked. Okay, I'm worried that like, it's just gonna have like a very scary face come out of it or something or it's gonna come after me. Okay, 
Alright, I think I can handle this game for quite some time, but I, I think there's going to be some point where I'm going to reach my threshold and I'm just not going to be able to do any more. Like, I'll, I'm going to reach that threshold of terror that I'm just like, I can't, can't keep continuing. Okay, there's another wardrobe, so I might have to hide again. Where are you, veiny baby? Or it could be something different. Okay. Alright, another wardrobe. Alright, I didn't actually have to hide from anything in that room, but... Oh. Creepy wake-up voices and creepy music. It's like a, uh... I don't wanna, I don't wanna look. Okay. It's sudden too, it's not like, it's not like pull back the veil or anything, it's just like, boom, it's straight on your screen. Okay, there's stairs. So I keep going down the stairs in this part. That music is setting up something big. Oh, it's the same. I think this is the same room. Yep. Okay, a lot of these rooms are the same. I think it's worth it to walk into each room just to check them, but... Okay, I might have to hide the next time I see. Oh, baby, baby. No, don't get me. Don't get me. Door. <laughs> he just ran right by me. Alright. Oh, oh, he actually is. So he's still following me. There's. Okay. Oh, alright. It's just a, um. Just a light. Oh! Okay. And everything is immensely worse with all the creepiness. Oh shit. Alright, so... So I fell and woke up, so I... That might have been like a death. So I... Oh, oh no, it's all different. Oh. Uh, eyes... Eyelids, but no eyes. That's... That's a no-no in my book. Yeah, the place is even more decrepit, so I imagine that was supposed to happen. So I want to go into this. All right, let him pass. Bye, bye, baby. Ah, you jerk. I have to go into. I have to go into this one up here to hide. So now I gotta let him go back that way, then I can continue to the right. There he is, alright. After about 10 minutes of waiting. No. No, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not in here. And you don't notice the cabinet opening? Okay. Baby gone. Gone, baby gone. There's another cabinet up here. Throw a curveball and send a second baby after me. What does that sound? There could be a second baby. Oh, what? Sticky keys. Oh! Damn it. Alright, alright. I know what just happened. Okay, send me out of the game. Because of sticky keys. Where did he go? Alright, it sent me out of the game because of sticky keys, because I keep hitting shift. 
you know, to run. So every time I hit shift, so it might send me out. So I'm going to have to correct that after this and just try not to run for the rest of it. Keep going. All right, so there's more than one baby. We've established this. Okay, so if I hide in this one, then he'll he'll walk by again. Yep, there he comes. Oh, I was expecting I have to wait again. That that last one, I had to wait like I I know I'm cutting that time out because I had to wait like. A full minute. It was literally just me sitting in the cabinet, just wondering where he is. I don't want to. I don't want to hit the sprint button though. Okay, good. I'm already here. Oh, I'm going upstairs now. I think this is the first time I've gone upstairs, really. Oh no, there's one more time. Oh, I have to hold it. I thought he was just doing the upstairs process on his own. No, you have to hold it the whole time. Okay, back to creepiness so there is actual parts of the game where like I have to avoid creatures so that's no uh, she stabbed oh just oh. okay all right uh just take that out of you and just put it into me all right, I'm in a padded cell now, so am I? Can I hide under the bed? Nope. Uh, do I look? They're not having a fun time out there, I can tell you what. So, I mean, I imagine if you're having these dreams that you would be, like, insane, but... Is the door open now? Yep, door open. I mean, I imagine if you're having these dreams, you might be like, you know, considered insane and have to be like isolated. This is just gonna add in a padded cell and. Nope, I don't want to wake up. There's gonna be something scary in in these windows. I can just feel it. All right, nothing in that one. All right, okay, there's something creepy in here. Oh. All right, block A security. So, okay, so I don't see that lit up, so I might not need to go down there. But that looks like the area where I'd like, I would need a key to get through. What's going on in cell two? Nothing. Okay, I have to walk around that. It looks like a body. All right, cell four. What's going on in cell four? Oh! I want to read that though. My God, why have they forsaken me? Okay, it was the same writing. Holy shit. Okay. I'm good. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm I'm perfectly fine. Not a not a thing in the world can get to me. Don't worry. Nerves of steel is what I have. I have nerves of steel and you will never penetrate my nerves of steel. No matter how fucking many creepy dolls you use and Flowers, block A, row three. And blood. Okay. I don't wanna, but. Just blood. Just blood. It was just some guy. He, he was perfectly fine. He didn't want, you know, my blood or anything. He just wanted to. Okay, I'll look. Okay. Started to close my eye there, but that, that was just. I, I had something in my eye. Okay, we're good. Continuing on. Then this one doesn't have anything going on, so it's probably gonna be the scary one. Nope, I was wrong. 
Alright, block B security. Do I have to go down there? Yeah, I have to go down there. Alright. Alright, go down the creepy stairs in the in the insane asylum. I mean, this has always been a good location for horror. An insane asylum, I mean, it's just like... It, it, it always works. There's places in horror that literally always work. Like, in a horror game, a, a prison always gets me. It always piques my interest, to say the least. I know it's... Oh, I just cut myself and I'm bleeding now. Okay, so it might... Whatever's gonna chase me next might be able to follow me by my blood bloody footprints so I have to be aware of my bloody footprints E V E R every oh everything is a lie everything is a lie <laughs> that's interesting that it, that it has that on the eye chart I was almost thinking that that was just going to be a normal eye chart until I started reading the letters and then realizing that the first word was everything. I don't, I don't think my foot is still bleeding. Which is good. Alright, time to check this one. All right, time to check this one. Hello. Are you gonna hurt me? You gonna hurt me if I get close to you? I think he might, I, th I think I don't wanna bump into that fella. I think he's gonna, I think he'd be a little upset with me if I hit him. Okay. All right, we're good. There's really been, there hasn't been anything like too bad in quite some time. That arm changes my mind though. I mean, the guy was creepy, the, the arm is creepy. I'm just thinking like veins being ripped from your arm, disturbing. But I don't want to like categorize. Can't speak right now. I don't know why. I don't want to put things in categories that like that. Like it's it's all equally disturbing. What I find disturbing might not be what other people find disturbing. But let's put it this way. That that's just about like as disturbing as you can get to me is just like slowly peeling away skin and tendons and things and I'm talking about it and giving myself a wee bit of goosebumpies and he's right there spooky man with a spooky plan but his with his eyes closed do I not want to get near there Okay, that really didn't like jump scare me, but it makes me not want to. Okay, there's. Oh, he's tall. Look at him next to me. He's very tall. He's like another two feet above me, and he's hunched over. Dining hall. All right, what's in the dining hall? This area is long. Like, this section's been pretty long. Kitchen? What are they cooking in the kitchen? You got some ham sitting there on the wall, I see. Oh, this doesn't meet regulations at all. I'm gonna have to shut the place down. Bloody handprints on the walls. This is how you store your food? I, I think, um, I think we should have a talk. Oh, I, I 
did that really quick. There wasn't anything in there, but... Oh! Oh! I hope I didn't go back, like, too far. I hope I don't have to do that all over again. Uh, either way, I'm kind of running up on time, so I think I have to end the video right here. So, thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please go down below and let me know. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.